That doesn't seem to work. There's no handle on the door. Hot dogs, burgers, salad, pies, fine hacks. Uh, that's about it. Welcome to the S and D diner. Hey, just so you know, that article in the Thimbleweed Nickel about botulism was a smear job. So, what can I do for you, honey? I'm a federal agent. Know anything about the dead body? Not too much, just scuttlebutt from the morning breakfast crowd. And I don't want to get into trouble, especially with a crazy person like him. You're not talking about me, are you? Shut up, Dave. We're the feds, you can trust us. What else do you know? Okay, honey, but you didn't hear this from me. I'd look into that crazy clown that lives out at the old circus. He's been out there since the circus closed down years ago. Never takes his makeup off. He's got serial killer written all over him. It all happened about nine or ten years ago. Ransom the Jerk was the featured act at Stupendous Brothers Circus. He was about ready to go on stage and meet his well-earned doom. Big night tonight. Full house after my raunchiest Tonight Show appearance. I really got Johnny good, that little jackwad. It's his own fault for not being able to take a joke. I better get ready to go on stage and insult the crap out of these thimbleweed idiots. I just need to fix my hair, put on my makeup and clown nose, and find my joke book. My circus poster, featuring the amazing Ransom the Clown. That's me, face. Meanest clown of 1977 and 1978. Ransom the Clown. Very cozy. My maid changed the sheets today. It's a prototype Ransom the Clown doll. It's a perfect likeness of me. Well, maybe the nose is a bit too big. I'm not ready for my fans. My hair is all frizzy, and I'm not wearing my special ransom clown makeup or nose. Where the f is my nose? It's an IOU. I, Carney Joe, loan ransom the f clown $1,000 and will hold his joke book hostage until I gets paid. What the hell is this? The number of fish swimming in Carney Joe's shooting gallery times four. The number of letters in the first word of the big top sign. The number of kids that Carney Joe has. Must have written it when I was on a bender. It's my lawyer's business card. My fridge. Look how clean my assistant keeps it. Empty, but clean. Fridge assistant hasn't replenished my supply. No time for a cold one anyway. State-of-the-art Zaptron 3000. That's tight, but it'll have to do. Glad I only have to wear it for a couple of hours. My hair is all frizzy, and I'm not wearing my special ransom clown makeup. I can't go on like this. Get your together, clown. It's an IOU. Ransom the clown lost a thousand dollars to me, Carney Joe, and I will hold his joke book hostage until I gets paid. It's my locked safe where I keep all my money. Ransom, I'm glad I caught you before you went on stage. Autographs are a hundred bucks. Ransom, I'm your business manager and lawyer. 
I don't want your autograph. Okay, 50 then. I just wanted to let you know that your mistress is waiting at your house in Aspen. And your private jet is being fueled and ready to whisk you there when the show is over. Also, we have a deal worth millions to license a line of toddler Ransom the Clown talking insult dolls. Did he get the liability clause waived? Correct. They will assume all liability when the kids grow up to be beepholes. Good. Toddlers start out as It's not my fault they end up that way. Okay, fine. 25 bucks. I should have been a dentist. F you! I'd rather be at my Aspen home. What a f easy job. Just stand and wave. Ah. It's my Ransom the Clown swear jar with 138 bucks in it. My contract states that I'm the only one who's allowed to swear. Anyone else caught swearing has to pay up. I'll just take the big bucks. I'm not a wannabe pirate. You'll never get me to climb into one of those. It must be that other clown's hat. I don't do hats. This goop keeps my clown fro erect. Can't have a limp clown fro or anything else. Ooh, my clown fro looks great now. It's my special custom made clown makeup. I am tired of putting it on every night. Sure as Wish there were a more permanent variety. Now there's the face I love. I look marvelous. Ready to knock him dead. It's fresh out of that crappy popcorn. Must be a huge crowd in the big top. It's fresh out of that crappy popcorn. Must try your skill. Come on over. Grand prize if you can shoot the hair up, Ransom the Clown. Try your skill. You got my money, Clowny? That's Ransom the Clown, asswipe. Okay, you got my money, Ransom the asswipe, Clown? One thousand clams or you're not getting your joke book back. It serves you right for playing the duckies. I need my joke book. The crowd's waiting for me. I told you before, you ain't getting it till I get the thousand bucks you owe me for the duckies. Plus, $138 in interest. Where the f am I gonna get that kind of dough? I have a show to do. 138 bucks in interest, you loan shark. You are putting a squeeze on me. Not my problem. Give me my joke for face. I told you before, you ain't getting it till I get the thousand bucks you owe me for the duckies. Plus, $138 in interest. Where the f am I gonna get that kind of dough? I have a show to do. 
138 bucks in interest, you loan shark. You are putting a squeeze on me. I don't know, ransom the asswipe clown. Maybe it's in your hidden safe. So, uh, how's the old ball and chain and kids, huh? My wife's doing fine, no thanks to you. And so are the eight kids. But they still cries themselves to sleep every night after that stare you gave them. You, I'm out of here. Grand prize if you can shoot the head. Hey, guaranteed the. Let's see if I can remember this combination. Okay, now. And finally... Tough da. Next time, I'm setting it to one, two, three. That's a load of moolah. It's exactly $1,138 in unmarked bills. No waiting, take a shot. You got my money, Ransom the asswipe clown? I have your money. A thousand bucks plus interest. Oh, so you decided to pay up. Yeah, well, not much choice. Now where's my joke book? Here, the jokes all suck. So how'd you get to be so famous with jokes like these? Yeah? What do you know about being funny? Uh, about as much as you do, which is nothing. Now, scram, clowny. You're scaring the customers. Win a fine leather jacket. Faces. I'm Ransom the insult clown. I hope no one gets their feelings hurt easily, and if you do, it's your own fault for not being able to take a joke. <laughs> What's the deal with all these Tron machines? That's some great priorities you got there. Yeah, you can't cure cancer or help the blind see, but at least you don't have to wipe your own asses thanks to the Toiletron 3000! You guys are obsessed with this Chuck guy. Seriously, I haven't seen brainwashing like this since the Manson family. Blink twice if you want me to get help. Hey, you, dude with the stupid mustache. You think you look like Magnum P.I.? A 70s porn star called. He wants his mustache back. <laughs> hey, you, lady with a huge nose. I say lady, but your beak suggests you're a toucan. You shouldn't have bought tickets for the show tonight, toots. You should be saving your money for a rhinoplasty. Hey you, kid with the ugly shirt. Are you 
colorblind? Your shirt is about to give me a seizure. I mean, I'm a clown, and even I wouldn't touch something that garish. Hey, you, kid with a crappy wheelchair. Were you in a past life or something? Seriously, kid, you're in a wheelchair, and you got a face that looks like that? God's definitely punishing you for something. Hey, you, ugly old lady with the hairy mole. Or is it your parasitic twin? Whatever it is, I hope you bought a separate ticket. Because if it's big enough to ride the roller coaster by itself, it's not freeloading in my audience. You will be forever sorry for what you've just said. I curse you to never be able to remove your makeup and to roam these circus grounds until the end of time. He went on for another two hours, insulting everyone he could. Some people laughed because they thought it was funny, but most laughed because they were uncomfortable, and laughing is the best way to hide from the embarrassment of others. But after the show, in his dressing room, there wasn't going to be any laughter. Ha! I killed tonight! One of my best shows ever! I hope that ugly old lady with a curse breaks a hip on the way home. Now to get this makeup off, hop on my private jet, and go see my mistress Cindy in Aspen. Yeah. What the f This f makeup isn't coming off! The f you, old lady! You up the you Come on! As much as he tried, his makeup wouldn't come off. That old lady wasn't just any old lady. She was Madame Morena, mistress of the dark arts. When she curses you, it's not an empty threat. Something Ransom was just now finding out. This makeup of that old my lady! Ransom, I've got some bad news. What do you want, you bald, greedy little can't you see I'm having a problem? Grab a tissue and some rubbing alcohol and help me, you Your private jet crashed while trying to land. Your wife found out about your mistress and she's taking everything you own except the house in Aspen. There was a fire in Aspen and your house burned to the ground. The toy and doll licensing deal is dead and they're suing you for breach. And one more thing. I quit. What? And go beep yourself. And that's why Ransom the Clown is such a creep. And you should go arrest him for murder. That's an interesting story. We'll go check up on him. Ah, delicious! I can't wait to eat one. It's turned off. We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important... That doesn't seem to work. It's an alien invasion, I tell you. Aliens are trying to make us stupid. Don't talk on the phone and you won't become an idiot. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. An old cash register. Where did we go wrong, Dave? I don't know. <laughs> but if we can pull this off, I think we'll be fine again. I love you, Dave. I just want things to go back to how they were. Me too, Love Muffin. Snuggle cakes.